Mysticism uh, is a possibility in every human being's life. It's just that it demands attention, dedication, involvement and commitment to explore aspects which are not yet in our present level of experience. The nature of human experience is such, our visual apparatus, our hearing capacity, our ability to smell, taste and touch are all always in context, in comparison. You cannot know one thing if you do not know the other, or in other words, you do not know anything without comparison. So mysticism essentially is not about searching in the forest or in the mountains or in the mountain caves. Mysticism is about exploring the very nature of our ability to experience life. The five senses that we have, as good as they are for our survival process and to enjoy the physical aspects of the existence, they are not enough to go beyond. So mysticism is not an exploration of the world or the cosmic space. Mysticism is a way of exploring and enhancing our ability to perceive beyond the limitations of five senses. If you have to go down this path, <laughs> it demands uh, uh, more attention than what is needed for survival, more attention what is needed to acquire your food or wealth or money, it needs a far more keener attention than that. Well, <laughs> you know, motorcycling demands attention, but that is also not enough. Mysticism needs much more attention. So, I would invite you to journey on, when I'm around, you must explore, because even with attention, without the needed guidance, you may take uh, <laughs> many fold more time and energy than with uh, guidance. Well, we are here just to do that, to enhance human ability to experience beyond the limitations of their senses.